All right, we're looking at the setup for the bond calorimeter lab, uh, just the part where we make the sample. You'll begin with your standardized run, and you'll be making a um, sample of benzoic acid that's in the jar. And then we'll be using this press to actually make it into a pellet. So let's just have a closer look here. So the first thing you want to do is weigh out uh, the required amount of benzoic acid in the balance room and you'll use um, a nice clean spatula and use a plastic weigh boat for that. And um, yeah, just weigh out the powder. You'll notice in your experimental procedure that there is a minimum value and a maximum value. So make sure, most importantly, that you don't exceed the maximum value. So go to the balance and get your benzoic acid. Um, then you want to come back here and just assemble this this way, like so. Okay, so there are two pieces here. One that looks like this on this side, and like this on the other. So you want to orient it this way, and the following one, like so. And then take your benzoic acid, and then curve the sides a bit here and put it in. I'm pretending I have a sample. And then we're going to mount it in place. Make sure that's in the center. And then grab the handle. And I'm doing this with one hand to show you here, but that's going to guide in. Should be in the center. And press that down. There's nothing in it right now, so that presses very easily. But you'll see when you have your benzoic acid powder in there, you will press it into a pellet. It looks like a little white vitamin pill. Um, to get it out, you want to, because it, it'll probably be stuck in here. If it's not stuck in there, that's great. It'll fall out into here. But if it is stuck, we actually turn this over and then turn this upside down. So now it's just going to sit on that top piece. It barely clears, but it does clear. And then just a little nudge with the handle will actually uh, pop that. And you'll see that it'll be sitting there on the bottom. And then at that point, um, you want to take that pellet out and you'll put it into a crucible. And the crucible at the moment is actually inside here, so I'm just going to pause that and come back. 